The rich, vivacious sound of Brockdown will fill the air at the House of Culture on Friday night as a list of artists grace the stage to bring you the best of their Brockdown albums, including some interpretations of hits from the late great Mr. Peters and Leela Vernon. Harrison Doggy King Bruce and Terry Brockdown Gal Ledland are lined up for performances on Friday night. My favorite song is When Billy's Gal Come Out. When Billy's Gal Come Out, then I'll come out for play. Or I got Billy's down my tongue, so don't you mess around. Nobody could get we all fire. That's my favorite song from. Like. Yes. Well, hold on a little bit about yours now. One of yours. Okay, so um, this year we have our very own original that we will be presenting on the stage at the Brom. And I have a very new one. And this one is called Ready for Christmas Money. This one I go. I say, we ready, ready for Christmas morning. Ready, ready for mash up the party. Oh, Lord. I say, we ready, we ready for it. Yeah. I want everybody to come out. You know, come out and support this thing. This thing sweet, you know. Like, for instance, they never know broke down Christmas would have been so nice. So nice. Oh, so nice. Never know broke down Christmas would have been so nice. So nice. So nice. So nice. When we start pure back up on table, jam. Bring the pig tail buck and make we start to bram. When you see me sleep with great tension, hand, start to jam, start to jam, start to jam. Uh-huh! Harrison Doggy King, the eighth Friday writer. Doggy King, who is from Hattieville, shared where the idea for his hit song, Move From Front and Side and Back of Me, originated. Move from front and side on the wrong and back of me. Be no like when me clean up, I people they touch me up. Be no like when me clean up, I people they mash me up. Cause I went time me clean up. They invite us when we have mental health week. So we found a table, we go over there and we had fun, have play sports and stuff. And then they have this dance day. So this day we, we go on it and, you know, every time I come somebody wants a cigarette or something. So one of my friends had a pack of independent cigarette. So but everybody they make a line. So, Everybody comes, sing, sing, sing the least song or the chorus line, sing a poem, and they get a cigarette. One man left in a line, one cigarette left. Somebody tell her, listen to me, man, you have to sing a song or sing a poem, because one cigarette left. But I don't know no song, I don't know no poem. Somebody pushed it down back, and they walk away. And the man start, move from front of side and bring a book of me. Move from front of side and bring a book of me. Meanwhile, the broke down girl, Terry Ledland, says there's space for diversity in the culture while preserving it. I love, love colors. And there's no rule or not any other books that uh, what cultural girl can use. Flores, uh, uh, um, what do you call it? Colors, colors here or dress a certain kind of way. Yes, we have to continue with culture in the dressing and, you know, so everybody could continue. But at the end of the day, New Year, New person in tongue. So if I see me have on a yellow outfit, for instance, maybe I have on a yellow wig too. That's how I feel. You know, I go with my colors. Ledland was part of a music workshop that the Brockdown Brown producer, James Sankar, held a while back in preparation for this and future shows. The whole idea of the Brown going forward, Sankar said, is to sell it as part of a tourism event. One of the main things that we're having this year that is different from the other years that we have a lot of new songs. Most of the artists are doing new songs this, this year. And so if you want to hear some of the new broke down songs, come out. One of, the, one of the key focus is that we want to link this to tourism. So let me speak a little bit about that. Yes. So Belize Music Agency is partnering with the government niche um, um, via a grant from, um, from UNESCO to basically make this an annual event tied to tourism so that Brockdown would then be part of the tourism mix. So the development of it is a true partnership with the private sector and, and the government niche um, in making this possible. And these are the kind of things that we think would make the industry grow and um, be more vibrant.
Vibrancy is exactly what the people at the Institute of Creative Arts want to see result from the event this year. Director of ICA, Kim Vasquez, says Friday night's Bram will not disappoint. Niche has uh, its, its mandate yes. to create a local and international platform to showcase and promote Belizean music. And Brokdong is definitely one of our Belizean genres. We also know that um, it tends to be one of the genres that we say is endangered. And so we need to ensure that you know we, we keep the legacy, we keep the music going um, for generations to come. So you can expect to have music non-stop on two stages. So from 7 o'clock right up until it's done, there will be music going. But along with that, we also have all of the traditional um, Christmas um, niceties. We have rum popo and all of the local wines, sorrel wine, your ginger wine, your black cake, um, your rice and beans, your Christmas ham, your, 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 um, your potato salad, your onion sauce. All of those things will be there in very close proximity. Tickets will sell for $15 at the House of Culture gate, but if you can buy your tickets in advance before 5 on Thursday evening at the Bliss Center for the Performing Arts Ticket Booth, the price will be $10. Reporting for News 5, I'm Marion Ali.